Guys, it is April 4th. Usually April 4th is like springtime, right? Trees start blooming, the flowers are coming, it's raining. Nope. <laughs> Not in good old Idaho. It's 8.10. I'm supposed to be at school in 10 minutes. Nope, it's a snow day. On April 4th, we have a freaking snow day. I'm just bong boozled. The snow gods are just like pouring it down. They don't plan on stopping anytime soon. Apparently, to the weather forecast, this is like the last week of winter, and the next week it's gonna finally start being sunny. Usually, I would be like happy because my dad loves the snow and like you can go skiing more and whatever, but the ski mountain is closed. So, snow can leave and walk out the door right about now. I'm freaking over it, can you tell? It's about to be a... <laughs> I'm reading this book for sci-fi and it just happened to be right there as soon as I needed it. It's actually really good. It's about time travel. I guess I can't complain too much because we did get a snow day, so <laughs> can't complain. So snow can leave, but me and Brooklyn just got back from the gym. I was driving down the road and I was like, this weather is terrible. I wonder if that was a snow day. And then I spoke into existence and then look what we got. I should probably be quiet. Everyone's still asleep. <laughs> Now that I think about it, I don't know why I made my bed because I'm probably gonna jump back in after I shower. These are my favorite, favorite products to use in the shower. This smells like a freaking sugar cookie festival. want to know the two best body lotions these together are my absolute favorite this is just like great for moisture it has a hydrolytic acid it's just great for the body this one i use for scent it smells amazing vanilla pistachio you guys have probably seen this everywhere because it's such a good brand both of these are linked to my amazon storefront in my bio if you guys want to try but i wouldn't recommend it if i didn't love it having children. Daxon's friends are over it and I'm watching them because my mom had to go to the store really fast and I go to check on them and I was like are you guys making good decisions and they're like no just being all jokester with me and Daxon goes we don't know what to do and I was like oh you can clean up the mess that you made in your room because Brock and Daxon literally cleaned their entire room last night and it's already a freaking disaster it looks like a tornado hit their room so I said that and Daxon's like oh never mind we know what to do and I was like or you can clean up the mess you made downstairs the hot cocoa mix because they made hot chocolate and they left an entire mess and I'm like do these kids just expect to come over and make a huge mess and then leave I guess that is what the definition of kids is but still have a little bit of respect and then one of the kids goes or we could not listen to you I just walked away and decided to choose the opposite of violence. So I walked away from the room without saying anything. And basically, they just gave me free birth control. So I guess I can thank them for that. Anyways, I've been insanely bored. You can't really go anywhere because the snow is pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring. And it doesn't plan on stopping. I put hot tea bags on my styes. I listened to some TED Talks. I unloaded the dishwasher, made a taco, did a teeth whitening thing. I just like, I'm kind of running out of ideas. I'm cleaning my room right now. It's almost done. I might read in a minute. Hi guys, currently laying in the sun because I've been craving vitamin D for months now and anytime there's like a little portion of sun in the sky I just try to enjoy it because winter is still here in my part of town. Uh, I need to leave soon. We, Brooklyn and Emily are going to Texas Roadhouse. We haven't been in so long and if you watch my videos in November, December, you know, you know how much I freaking love Texas Roadhouse and me and my friends love it. I'm excited to have a roll in my hand. I'm just really enjoying life right now. I feel happy with myself, happy with my family and friends and Anyways, I just wanted to express my gratitude. If you ever feel like down or just like, ugh, like bleh, I promise you this comes from experience. Just make a list of things we're grateful for. Sometimes we definitely take advantage of the things we're grateful for. Like I know I do. I am so thankful that I get to park in the garage because if I was not, my car would be freezing every single morning. I would have to shovel the driveway. Like it would just be a whole mess. And I'm so grateful that I'm allowed to park in the garage. My phone charger wasn't working the other night and it made me realize how grateful I am for phone chargers. Also gratitude is like the highest vibration so if you're into manifesting gratitude is like the best way to do it through but anyway
anyways, just make a list of things you're grateful for in your head because we are all lucky to just be having air in our lungs right now, you know? Okay, I'm late. It's 6.30. We're supposed to meet there at 6.45. I'm actually fine on time, but I still need to get ready. This is the fit for dinner. Very cozy. I already have my makeup done. I just want to do a little touch-ups. This is the Pink Asm Charlotte Tilbury favorite blush ever. I'm not just saying that because it's Charlotte Tilbury. I'm saying it because I mean it. I think part of the reason I'm in a really good mood is because I have an acting class tomorrow I'm really excited about. I've been looking forward to it for like a month, so that's fun. In my first hour today, we watched this movie. It's like an Italian movie. I wish I knew the name of it because I bet you some of you have watched it. But we had to watch it in Italian subtitles. And it was very hard to like pay attention and like have one eye looking at the subtitles and the one looking up. But it was very interesting. And the acting was good and it was fun to watch. And I'm excited to finish it tomorrow. Cotillie, face mask, Cotillie. I'm so sorry. I do not know how to pronounce it. If you're French, let me know. And then it is cold outside. Oh, can you see me? No. <laughs> I might just wear this because it's cozy. <laughs> Fun. I left my black North Face coat at Ian's house, so that's unfortunate. My shoes are downstairs. Alien Mugla perfume, my favorite. <gasps> Where are my rings? Oh boy, that's a problem. Don't worry guys, my mom put them on the window seal. My favorite ring, it has an eye on it for Ian. <laughs> I promise we're not this annoying in public. We were just having a lot of fun this day. We're gonna get kicked out. There you go. Oh wait, I forgot to do my motion. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, so we're going to Ulta and TJ Maxx and there's two cops outside. So I think there might have been someone who was stealing. So that's kind of scary. Daddy, she just went rock. <laughs> They sell truly. Hey, I bought that from my mom for Mother's Day and oh, she doesn't even like use roses. it. Mmm, that smells good. Here, smell. Yum, right? Attention, this area is being recorded. <laughs> it is being recorded. <laughs> I'm so funny. We should do a fit check. I actually I got this from TJ Maxx. <laughs> Crazy. Pack Sun, Nike, Uggs. This is from DI. This is from a little boutique. Urban. Oh, these are from where we're at. TJ Maxx. This is from. Oh, this baby, this is old. These are from Pink. These are from Maritzia. These are. These are your bra too. <laughs> this hat is from Vans. I just got it. It's new. This shirt is from Zara. This necklace is from Bum. Has a little E on it. And then these earrings are from H and M. And these overalls are from Dickies. Basic Vans that everyone has. Fun. I think our outfits are cute. I like this one so far. Let me explain it to you. Sweet, very springy, definitely some vanilla in there. Like cookies, kind of. Yes. Oh, is that juicy couture? A juicy yeah. couture candle? Are you kidding me? This one smells like volcano. And this I smells this like um, artificial like ice cream. Like, like um, what's it called? I shave ice in a chapstick. That's what it smells like. Yeah, hey, ice. let them smell it. <laughs> Emily still doesn't <laughs> smell it. She's like trying to smell it. This is like a cute little small one. I love that smell. This one's home. for you, California Beach House. Oh, thank you. I just want like a. Look at like all the amazing options. Oh my gosh, guys, they color coded it. Like the amount of time that like, took, that's so like sweet jewels. of them. <laughs> Got it! Dude, I'm literally gonna take a shower. So you're gonna have to get out of here.